<laughs> Did it feel good beam? The four drink special. My name is Dylan, and today we will be doing four drinks in one review. Now, as you can see here, by the old ribbon on my shirt, we've got four fantastic drinks to lay out today. We have Intense Energy Drink Electric Citrus, Intense Energy Drink Power Punch, Intense Energy Drink Bear Voltage, and the final drink, Mountain Dew Rise Energy Pomegranate Bluebird. Which is funny because the rise looks like it's in the Doom font. Anyway, today we will be using Monchon Glace, which is actually. Italian for glass, man. So, which of these drinks will we be drinking first? This one. Let me get a sniff. It just kind of smells like seltzer water. It is yellow. I can I can assure you that. It's got a very nice head to it, as you can see, with all the bubbles. Please ignore any loud noises you hear as people are driving past my home. It kind of just looks like a very fancy champagne. Maybe it will taste as such. No, allow me. To put it into its rightful home. AKA, a trash bag. Next up on the chopping block, we've got either Power Punch or Berry Voltage. And the, the, the Mountain Dew. I say we go Berry Voltage. Okay, this smells a lot like berries. Maybe it would taste just like a nice fresh berry. Oh, it is the same piss yellow color as the one before. Though I will say it is slightly redder, I, I think. I, I believe so, as you can see here. Um, doesn't smell too bad. Yeah, no, again, that's just really generic tasting nothing. It has a slight berry taste in the back of it. But other than that, uh, it's just fizzy water. And maybe a hint of lavender. Didn't really take this one through. Yeah. Now the glass has been clear. We will move on to the <laughs> power punch, which is purple. I hope it's not the same weird yellow color as the ones before. No, it's red. I mean, it's I, I, it's punch. I. Notably, this one smells a lot like just Hawaiian punch, you know, with the 
fancy surfboarding man, I like him a lot. He reminds me of myself as I was long ago. It, it really just smells like Hawaiian punch and slight carbonation. That's actually really good. I could see myself actually just finishing this. This is this is a, a, a good. If you find this, it's okay. It's, it's definitely something you could drink. I know what to do. I think we should answer a fan letter. That's right. A fan's letter. Now, today's letter comes from D. Okay, at gmail.com. They say, Dear Dylan, if you were trapped on a remote island and could only bring two things with you, what would those two things be? Hmm. Well, if I had to pick what those two things would be, it would probably be an entire franchise of Arby's, as well as probably my Nintendo Switch. I think that would be the best thing, because then I could play all my favorite games, like Super Mario Odyssey and Zelda Breath of the Wild in Animal Crossing New Horizons. As well as you will go to two, three. I think it's time we calm down a little bit and enjoy our last drink as I prepare a snack for myself. Um. Today we will be enjoying Wendy's Biggie Bag with our Mountain Dew Rise Energy. Which offers immune support and a mental boost. It's also blue, as you can tell. Let's dig in to the Wendy's $5 Biggie Bag. Got a little bit of ranch in my mouth. Tempting to open it. Anyway, we have the ranch dressing with a chicken nugget. Eh, tastes okay. Not the best chicken nuggets I've ever had. Now, any foodie worth its salt knows that Wendy's has a new campaign showing off their extra crispy fries. Let's test these out. Mm. <sighs> oh wow, that's really good actually. It's got that uh, slight tangy taste. I, I don't know how to describe it. It's really good though. I would definitely recommend this. It's got a very like nice fruity flavor and it doesn't just taste like creatine or whatever the energy thing is. Finally, we have the bacon double stack. With crispy bacon chewy bits of onion and a nice in-between of their irregularly shaped meat patties this is definitely a good burger here's a fun bit of trivia the older i get the more i realize that i think i like mayonnaise a little bit more on burgers than just a regular ketchup and mustard ketchup and mustard is good but i Something about mayonnaise on a burger just feels right. And that was my review of the Wendy's $5 Biggie Bag. As well as some other shit. Overall, 
this has been a very fun and eye-opening experience. And if you like this experience, then don't forget to like that subscribe button and hit the like button as well. Now, I'm going to go take a nap. You don't mind. Which I'm sure you don't. Now do you? Duh. <laughs> Did it feel good?